Okay, just a quick note. Uh, these uh, beautiful Battle Creek Awards are given to us by the Neighborhood Planning Councils. Uh, they have members or membership that uh, looks around in their certain areas and finds homes and businesses that they think are, are worthy of, uh, of us looking at and everyone else looking at and admiring as well. So I'll call some people up here and the commissioners would come up as well. Uh, the first one is from Neighborhood Planning Council number 10, which is Ward number 5, that would be me, uh, 2245 West Columbia Avenue, Suite 104, which is the Remix Salon. Is there anyone here from there? Come on up. And your name? Samantha, welcome. Thank you. Next would be uh, Neighborhood Planning Council number four, ward number three, 145 Garrison Avenue, and Lorraine Bessinger. Did I say that correct, Lorraine? All right, next would be uh, NPC number two, ward number two, 12 Buckeye Street, and uh, Lionel and Maria Guadalupe Hurtado. Is that close? Did I say it close? Are they here? We'll make sure that they get that, though. Thank you. Uh, neighborhood Planning Council number three, ward number four, 256 Fairfield Avenue, Carol Ferguson. Is Carol here? Next is Neighborhood Planning Council number three, ward number four, 696 Capitol Avenue Southwest, Body Bronze. Anyone here from Body Bronze? No. We actually do um, make sure that these are delivered to these people, to their business or their residents, to make sure that they're aware of it and they receive it face to face from someone versus us mailing it or something like that. NPC number five, ward number one, 49 Emerald Avenue, Thomas Holder. Is Thomas here? Nope. Okay. And the last one is NPC number five, ward number one, 1170 West Michigan Avenue, fire station number five. Anyone here from there? Okay. No, they're busy. <laughs> okay. So we have a couple of folks up here. You can see the vast array when I gave the addresses out, how they're all over the city of Battle Creek. And what I like to say when we present these is home is where the heart is. And even to those firefighters, if you ask them, that's their home away from home as well. And we can't thank you enough for treating your business and your residents the way that you do and leading by example. And we're so proud of you and thank you for keeping up your residents and your businesses for us. Thank you very much, folks.